And you put a lot of miles on your feet. Injury and aging can also impact your mobility. But there are ways to help those aching feet. CNN's Judy Fortin explains. Vincent Wall spends a lot of time on the treadmill, but this sweat on the machine has less to do with his waistline and more to do with his feet. Last winter, Walls was bounding up the stairs when his Achilles tendon snapped. I heard like a rip, and when I went to put weight on it, I couldn't stand on it. After surgery, Walls' physical therapist recommended he get into rehab quickly to stretch out yep. those tendons and muscles to There's keep a... him strong. We know that in our 30s, um, you know, we start to lose strength in our, in our body at, at a very young age, and, and that progresses, they say, about 8% a year. And as you get older, muscles and tendons begin to shrink, making them tight, which is tough on your feet. When you have tightness in one area in the body, no matter where it is, you're normally going to make up for that loss of motion somewhere else, and that's especially true in the foot. That means starting in your 30s, you need to stretch, especially in your calves and feet. It can help you avoid a lot of overuse injuries. Certain things like like um, a, a tendonitis of the Achilles or tendinosis, which is more of a degenerative process of the tendon. You can get, you know, midfoot pain or pain in your toes, all because there's certain um, flexibility issues. By the time you reach your 40s, your feet have taken a real pounding. Deterioration of bones and muscles may cause the arches in our feet to become lax and lose support, making it tough to walk. And with age, especially in women, can come osteoarthritis. You start to see degenerative changes in the joint space themselves. The way we try and combat those from a therapy standpoint is weight-bearing exercise. Doctors recommend at any age, make sure you get a good fitting shoe. Shoe wear is definitely important um, and, and, and probably even more specific to whatever task it is that you're doing. If you run, don't wear tennis shoes. Standing on your feet, watch the size of the heel. The wrong footwear can cause shin splints and joint problems that could give you a lifetime of pain. As for Vincent Wall's Achilles tendon, it seems back to normal. Although rehab isn't the most exciting place to be, he knows it's the healthiest place for his foot. Judy Fortin, CNN.